Hi guys, I'm Rick Crawley with Achilles Heel Tactical and welcome back to this UF Pro series of Carbine Fundamentals. In this episode, we're gonna be covering weapons transitions from rifle to pistol and recovery. guys now we're going to talk about weapons transitions from rifle to pistol and within transitions we're always looking for the most efficient economy of motion so in order to set up a transition and to first identify why we're transitioning i'm going to take an empty mag simulating that i just ran dry instead of going into an emergency reload due to the size of target and distance from that target and knowing my level of skill set and ability at that distance in that time i'm going to decide to transition rather than reload. Going through the motions prior to engagement, when I come up and fire, I'm gonna feel that light and reduce recoil. I'm immediately going to separate my dominant side hand from the gun and with my non-dominant side hand, guide the weapon system straight down. I'm then going to establish purchase, high firm purchase on that pistol. As this weapon system drops down, I'm now going to marriage and drive straight out with now my pistol. After I finish the engagement with pistol, I can take the initiative to pause there with what works, having what works stay out. I can tack reload my secondary prior to fixing my primary. Now I bring my primary back up. I will obviously observe on an empty chamber. And at night, the reason I'm not putting this back, I'm not putting this away is I can recess this light to then identify the empty chamber. Once I've identified an empty chamber, I have the time to do so. I'm now going to stow the pistol and fix the rifle. All right, so setting this up in full motion. All right, again, setting up for that transition is exactly like setting up for that reload. Empty mag, one in the chamber. On signal, I'm gonna come up, fire one to the blue, transition three to the white with pistol. Pause, recover the rifle, observe, the empty chamber, stow pistol, fixed rifle. Now the weapon can then go back on safe. All right, so you're seeing the consistency within the process that I have from both reloads and transitions. I'm not taking the extra time nor adding the extra step of manipulating that safety. Now let's talk about the reason I'm taking that pregnated pause between the transition. All right, setting it up again, one to the blue, three to the white. Pause, attack, reload. And the reason I'm taking that pregnated pause here, this is the only weapon system that works. I just had to switch to a secondary weapon system, had to engage with it, took the extra time to attack, reload. And this is currently the only weapon system that works. From here, bring up the primary weapon system, identify what's wrong with it when I have time and space to do so, stow the pistol, fix the rifle, get it back up and running, and once you are done, throw the weapon on safe. All right guys, this concludes this episode. Again, this should not be considered an all-inclusive summary of my curriculum. <laughs>